Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray and joining me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And on the way, live action from the old Svenskan coming right up. It's Dior Gordon and they take on Hammerby. Thank you, Derek. It's just flicking through my notes at this one. Everything pointing to a really lively matchup. This is fingers crossed, eh? This is the lineup for the home team. If you like wingers, you'll love this league. Yeah, absolutely. I love to watch a winger play, especially with pace and power. The central striker will stay more or less in front of the goal. The support will be provided by the three central midfield players. The back four is pretty conventional, but the fullbacks will be asked to support from behind. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. This particular setup is becoming more and more in favour. Yes, Derek, one central striker, two wingers who will provide the width, a very narrow three in midfield. The back four, the two full backs will be expected to support, but also defend and help out the centre backs. And the game begins. Larson. Ericsson with it. Effective looking pass. Delivering it into the box. And the cross didn't beat the first man. Sandberg it's opening up for them dangerous looking attack and can they make one of these passes count and he read it well and plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position and players waiting in the centre Magnus Eriksson. Teammate and support. Rasmus Schüler. Every pass hitting its target. Can he keep his composure? Rasmus Schüler, Jakob Une Larsson, Aslak von Vitri. And a textbook interception. Rasmus Schüler, good pass. Looks promising this. Ball's gone. It is to be a throw in. Schuler. Holmberg, an important interception. Loves to attack from the wide areas. And players waiting at the far post. And behind it goes the concession of a corner here.
and firing it into the area relatively straightforward to mop up defensively Karl Holmberg Eriksson with it Holmberg and played the pass well and they'll get ready for the throw in Schüler Karl Holmberg good tackle Bojanic well they're on the scent of something positive just looking for the right moment for that final pass but it was completely miscontrolled disappointing Rasmus Schüler here's Larsson Ekdal Schüler and now Schüler What can he do from here? Lovely ball over the top. Can he put them in front? Oh, it's gone in! A derby goal, the first of the contest. Electric. Well, here's the replay, and the passing move is almost unstoppable. The movement is key for me, and the finish is superb, sharp, clinical, it's a lovely goal. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Bojanic. Sandberg. Darian Bojanic. And the emphasis is on creativity. And slipped through beautifully. And he's found a bit of daylight. The high press was very much on. Making progress. Simon Sandberg. Mads Fenger. Bojanic. Well, there to intercept. Magnus Eriksson. An attack full of promise. Retaining possession proving difficult. Real danger. He might be able to carve something out. Darian Bojanic. Fruitful looking attack. Bojanic. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, you're right. He has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Anderson, Darian Bojanic, Schüler, 
Schüler, Karl Holmberg. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Could cross it in here. Aslak von Vitri. And now Schüler. Firing it towards goal. And not testing the keeper at all with that effort. Looks promising this. He takes aim. Good defending to prevent the chance. Fenger. Already closing him down here. Can they hit on the break? Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Not enough cut and thrust, but they keep possession. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. And winning it back. Bojanic. Anderson. Simon Sandberg. Unable to keep the ball that time. And a promising look attack, but comes to nothing in the end. What can he do from here? Surely the equaliser. Can he finish? And he's done it. Parate again. A magnificent game unfolding. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. But you do have to ask questions about the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't keep getting beat at the near post like that. They are committed to making the substitution here. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Schüler. And giving it away. Abdul Khalili. Khalili. It might be on for them. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. It looks promising. Well, wasted opportunity here. Would have been a decent chance, but offside the verdict. So, making the substitution now. Anderson. Fjolison. Sandberg. No worries for the keeper. Elliot Keck. Eriksson with it. Now can they counter clinically?
Magnus Eriksson. Well, can they open up the defence here? Clattered away. Dahl. Karl Holmberg. Strong but fair tackle. Ten minutes left for play in this match. Anderson. Level pegging, but can they change that? Anderson. Bojanic. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. And space to exploit, maybe. Aslak von Vitri. And cleared behind for what is going to be a corner kick. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Corner kick played in, and he clears the danger. Real danger. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. And after the cross, defensive action called for. Well, they've decided to make a change. Vitri. Can they get in behind them? Opportunity to deliver the cross. Looks promising this. Dangerous looking attack. This looks promising. Has someone to play it to. And unable to keep possession. And there's the whistle. They cannot be separated after 90 minutes.